Hello again, all Zensite process, etc. I have a standard spoon here, and basically I'm going to replicate your um, I'm going to replicate your spoon bend, but using nothing but a perfectly straight spoon. Like I said, this was a perfectly straight Delco stainless steel spoon. I bend it a couple of times to weaken it, kind of like this. And all I have to do is it's quite simple. I'm not using focus or anything. I just simply have to bend it, and then I can start twisting it. And see, it's now starting to twist a little bit, and one twist in, and it's relatively easy. I mean, I didn't focus or do any power of intention or stuff like that. It was just simple that. Here's the kicker. Because of this, I'm just simply using straight strength. I can, with a little bit of focus, bend this thing back. It's all about leverage. See? By using the right, correct amount of leverage, I can bend this thing back into shape relatively well. There's still a little bit of distortion left in the side of the spoon. But the point is that even a feat of a... Uh, sorry, I've just got to use my leg now to get the rest of it out. But the point is that either way, it's a feat of sheer strength. Not... Uh, this is a, like I said, this, this bend was a feat of sheer strength, not a feat of using chakras or any of that mystical stuff. Here, better yet, I'll bend it back into shape. And I'll leave that twist in there. Hopefully my girlfriend won't mind. Uh, so, but anyway, yeah, so basically, this is a twisted spoon. And um, because of the fact that I uh, used the power of my mind to do this, there is, uh, sorry, because of the fact that I just used my simple strength to do this, you know, there's no trick or, you know, there's no paranormal focusing intent in here. It's all pure magician's trickery. Um, sorry to disillusion you, Spoon Ben, but all that focusing and stuff like that, that's just simply uh, being able to tap extra body strength. Um, people, uh, mothers have been known to lift up ends of cars on sheer adrenaline just to save kids. Um, Chris Angel in one of his uh, Mind Freak episodes actually lifted one end of a taxi just by sheer muscle training. So um, I'm sorry, this is not paranormal. All that chakra stuff really does not play into it. And uh, for skeptics who have claimed it's like uh, cuts in the spoon and stuff like that, you don't need trick spoons to do it. Uh, you just simply need to remember uh, stuff like sheer physics, including leverage, etc., to be able to twist a spoon like this and lo locate the weak spot and use its malleability. So, um, sorry to disillusion you, um, spoon uh, Zen site process. Please quit doing. Um, please quit uh, making fraudulent claims on your uh, website, on your uh, videos, etc. Um, like I said, I've already easily duplicated it here, as you can see. And um, so, yeah, sorry, sorry to burst your bubble, everybody. And uh, for believers, well. If you want to look for a proof of telekinesis, you better do it elsewhere, because spoon bending just ain't it.